morning. My name is Billy Bolson from Diakati Fitness Performance Life in San Francisco. We've been doing a blog series trying to point out common mistakes or errors that we see a lot of people making in the gym on their own. So today I have one of our strength guides from Diakati, Chris Dovali with me. Thanks Chris. No Thanks problem. For your time, Definitely. Man. Thanks for having me. So Chris, what do you th say is your like biggest common error that you see people making? Um, not engaging their muscles, not having the mind-body connection. A lot of times I'll have clients uh, doing a particular exercise and I ask them, where do you feel it? And they say, I don't know. <laughs> and uh, okay, so we're wasting our time kind of with that. So what you're gonna do, you wanna be able to, whatever exercise you're doing, you wanna be able to engage that muscle. You wanna be thinking about that muscle while you're working it. You wanna be able to contract it on the dime. Awesome. Even before there's resistance, you should be able to flex a particular muscle on command with your mind. You should have that control. So, um, you know what, and that a lot of times I tell my clients, and, like for example, if you're doing a bicep curl, I, don't, I want you to think less about doing the movement and more about feeling what is doing the movement. To the help, actual I want you bicep. To feel it, exactly, yeah. right? Yeah, so let's actually, there you go. Definitely. So, even before we start, one thing you can do to cue it, yep. to, you know, to turn your muscle on, you can uh, take some light dumbbells or barbell, whatever exercise you're gonna do, take a light weight and just do it. Go through the motions, maybe 30 reps, 50 reps, however you need to, however many you need to do to get that muscle really burning. And then you'll understand, oh, that's where I'm supposed to be feeling it. Perfect. And then you could go up and wait. Yeah, and especially for beginners, that's a good way to like really warm it up and Definitely. feel it. And then once you get more advanced, you can just drop back to just going straight in. Right? Definitely, Perfect. and you can use your finger too to touch the muscle that you're trying to contract awesome. even before you do the exercise, so if it's chest, you're flexing the chest, bicep, what we're gonna to demonstrate today, cool. you should be able to flex and feel your bicep get hard before you even grab a dumbbell or a barbell. Sweet. So, thinking about, like I always tell my clients, as you're doing the curl, like yes. do a couple, as you're doing the curl, like you see he's cueing it with his hand, but also think about feeling a muscle is fibrous. So the muscle fibers are shortening and the fibers are lengthening. So thinking about as you're going up. Oh yeah, really squeezing that muscle. Feel flexing it. it, flexing it, flexing it, keeping the tension on it the whole time. And like you were talking about earlier, make sure you're squeezing just as hard or even harder on the way down. Most people just Oh yeah, let it definitely. Go, right? uh, the negative uh, portion of the movement. So yeah. on the way down. A lot of people don't even think about that. They're thinking about the way up and then just let it fall awesome. on the way down, yeah, let it right. fall. That's half the battle. You know, you're stronger on the way down than you are on the way up. So definitely want to take advantage and slow down that tempo so you're really feeling it on the way down and keeping it flexed. Cool. And one last ho or hint, I would say, you can also stop halfway in the movement until you really feel the muscle charge on and burn. If you're gonna push up halfway down, if you're gonna squat halfway and hold until you feel the right muscles doing it, then continue going, right? So definitely stay in the muscle, right? Stay in the muscle, think about the muscle you're trying to work. Awesome. Learn how to contract it and start practicing that mind-body connection. Cool. You'll get way more out of your uh, workout. And you're gonna be in the moment. Like don't be thinking about work, don't be thinking about dinner. Think about your muscles, your body, be right in tune with your body the whole time. You'll get much better results. Totally, right? totally. If you're in here, you're awesome. focused, you shouldn't be thinking about anything else, you should be in the moment. Perfect. Definitely. Thanks, man. Yeah, Thanks so much. Thank you. Good luck, you guys. Give it a try.